Hi, I'm Mary Norris, and today we're going to deal with the difference between hyphens, 1N dashes, and 1M dashes. Now, it's really simple. The hyphen is the short mark. It's used to make a compound word, such as cinder block walls. Also, you use a hyphen when you break a word at the end of a sentence. Now, 1N dash is a hybrid between a punctuation mark dash, which means I'm interrupting, and a hyphen. It links two compounds that are already double. Our famous example at the New Yorker is the New York dash New Haven Railway. Because a, a little hyphen in there, it just is not enough to, to hold those two rail lines together. They each have two words, so they need a stronger mark in between them. We use them very sparingly. We also use them in baseball scores. You know, the Yankees won five, one and dash, zero. The dash is a whole different thing. It's long. It's called a 1M dash because it's the width of a capital letter M. The 1N is the width of a capital letter N. And it's a very versatile mark of punctuation. It can be used to separate off part of a sentence that you might be able to put commas around, but if there's extra punctuation in it, it's easier and cleaner. It makes a cleaner sentence if you use a dash. Many of them come in pairs. Here's a very simple example. Recent investigations, dash, including a pending case involving a man believed to have been Sinaloa's highest ranking tunnel manager, dash, have provided some answers. Could have been commas in there, but it makes it clearer the spine of the sentence. The 1M dash is the only one that's a true mark of punctuation. It separates some part of the sentence from another, or it, it indicates a pause. And it can be used more informally as either a colon or a semicolon, especially in dialogue. I don't like semicolons in dialogue because I don't think people speak in semicolons, period.